So growing up in the 1970s and 80s, there were many products that reflected uh, us as residents of the North Shore. Uh, some of them were uh, junk food products, chocolate bars. But this product probably fed more children and more needy families than was given credit for. Because no matter how poor you were, you could basically afford this. It could be used with any type of pasta, uh, spaghetti, macaroni. Sometimes the company that would produce this, you would buy the pasta, pasta products of uh, the company. Now, we're going to talk about the legend of Catelli meat sauce. Now, uh, according to their website uh, for uh, Catelli, uh, Catelli canned meat sauce has been a family favorite for years. It can be used with uh, your favorite pasta or other food with quick and hearty meal. Now, the only problem with this uh, sauce, and the meat sauce is the best, it, uh, it is kind of high in sodium, but that's uh, part of the, any type of uh, product that involves something that tastes so good. Why Catelli uh, uh, is considered a fan favorite? Because back in the day, people had uh, no fridge to put in coal uh, past the sauce. It had no, uh, no shelf life if it was open. But the Catelli cans, they came in a uh, big enough can you could use one or two for your uh, spaghetti uh, product. Now, um, New World Pasta uh, owns the Catelli brand. It's a uh, uh, wholly owned uh, subsidiary of uh, Ebro Foods. Now, what a lot of people uh, didn't know that originally it was owned by Borden Foods, which was a... Uh, uh, a, a strong uh, presence amongst uh, you know people use dairy products for many years now we really don't know when Catelli showed up in the shelves again it's probably uh, the 60s or 70s but when people would go to the store uh, that would be their pasta sauce there was other known name pasta sauces canned or otherwise but why this is why Catelli is so popular the it takes a different consistency when hot but a different consistency when cold it almost expands on its taste and flavor and it's something that children love because it has a nice sweet aftertaste i remember uh, years ago when people uh, didn't have catelli sauce uh, uh, sauce and pasta was what not a normal meal for most acadians and maritimers back in the day but for some reason when catelli showed up you see white pasta can only go go so far but with Catelli, it gave enough of the, the meat taste and the product taste where basically it was accepted as part of who we are, basically wanted a good meal. I, I think every university student, every high school student, every grad school, grade school student in the 1970s owes a lot of education to Catelli Pass and Catelli products because when they came home, they could heat it up, they could eat it cold, and like I said, it was just tastes so good. So you have a chance. Catelli products are uh, available at various stores across the Maritimes, including Dollarama. You can get the bigger can size. Usually the can goes for $1.25, which is kind of ironic. Even with inflation, that's still cheaper than it was back in the 1970s. So crack open a can of Catelli. If you haven't had it, but if you have had it, go down to memory lane and enjoy the taste and the fellowship. There's nothing better with also a slice of homemade bread with cheese was on the side to dip in your Catelli sauce after you finish off the pasta. Mmm, good. And for, for dessert, of course, either get a, a Vachon cake or a, a Diet Pepsi to uh, wash it down. But uh, like I said, Catelli's best with not toasted homemade bread, but just the regular, you know, butt ends or the, the big slice. You know, it'll, it'll feed, it's fed millions and it will feed millions for years and years. And if I had five cents for every can of Catelli, I've eaten or bought for different people, I'd be a millionaire. A million times over. Have a good day. Bye.